Hey guys, this is Chris with Affiliate Tube, and today I'm going to answer a question a lot of you have been asking me about about video PBNs and syndication. So I use a tool you can find at syndable.com. That's S-Y-N-D-A-B-L-E.com. I'll put that link under this video and it may be on your screen as well. If you go there, you're going to find the exact product that I use, which you can see here on the screen, to syndicate to my video blogs. Now, I have a lot of different syndications set up. So, for example, I have some uh, blogs where I will syndicate my content to, and then I have plugins on that site which will syndicate my content out to social sites or Tumblr accounts or just some other things uh, to help get those pages uh, or those posts indexed and ranked better. So, this tool has become one of my favorites to use for syndication and getting rankings. Now, I'm not going to show you the names of my PBN network. I'm not going to reveal all that stuff here. But down here, you can see where my last syndication was, where I promoted um, a, a product called EverZippy. And this here tells you your account name, the service. You can see how I, I use mostly my WordPress self hosted sites on here. And uh, I do have a few tumblers. It tells you what, whether the status was successful or failed. This one failed because I just added it and I think I put the pass, password in wrong. I haven't checked it yet. But, but anyway, up here at the top, it's going to tell you how many accounts you have added. You can group them, how many syndications you have, whether they're failed or not. And then over here is where you can add everything. And what's really cool about this is, number one, if I go to my accounts and add account, I can go here and enter the name. I can assign it a group. And then also I can select the service and look at all of these services you can do. You can add Facebook pages, Twitter. You can actually add videos to this and it will upload them to YouTube accounts. You can uh, upload or post to WordPress sites as well as your own self-hosted. And you can see all the others here that you can also submit to. So if you're into video, it also has daily motion. And then they have a few private blogs here you can post to. Just keep in mind though, um, I upgraded to the pro version with this because I wanted some extra stuff with it. So you may have to do that if you want to get access to some of those private groups to post to. But adding it is as simple as adding a name, assigning it a group if you have groups created, selecting the service and adding it. And then it's going to ask you to connect it with your username and password. It's going to connect it. And then once you do that, you can go to your campaigns and you can add a new campaign. And so we'll just say test and I can syndicate it out to a single account. So say I have 16 blogs added on here, I can choose just one of them. But if I've added them into a group, I can actually do groups. So I can select account groups and I can just do the whole group of PBN blogs right here. I can choose to drip them or not. This one I'm just going to do all at once. We'll do create. Okay, now we're going to go to this next page where we're going to set it up. So right here it says we want to start the campaign immediately when we submit it. So I'm going to minimize this and now we're going to go to our blog editor. So here all we have to do is enter the information that we want to be syndicated. So for this we would put in a title. It does support syntax so you can put that kind of content in here to make your titles different each time it goes out to a different site. You can add some tags here. You can add your blog content and you can also add videos and so embed videos and this is what's really cool because on well, most of my blogs what I will do is I will come up here and I will put in my YouTube video link here which puts it at the top of the content and then below that I will put a bunch of content in Spintax so when it submits it it's got the video embedded on the site and it has the content underneath of it which is unique for each post and of course you can add your links for your affiliate links to go um, uh, what I do is a lot of my blogs that I use are very high authority blogs and so what I will do is I will embed my video put content down here then in the content I will use anchor text linking back to my website post review or I will um, also link back to my YouTube video so those links going back to those are going to really help those to rank better you can use a video embed code here I never do this I always just come up here and just I just add my video right here by just adding the link. You can maximize this. You can do by code if you want to do it that way. You can add images. Pretty much anything and everything you need here. You can use different headers for it. Bold, underline, and remove font style. 
right here is where if you want to spin your content so if your content is not already spun that you have ready you can come down to spinning and add your content spinner so if I go to add profile I can select my service and right now it's spin rewriter which is one of the most popular ones I'll put the link for that under this video too if you're interested in it and you can integrate that with this so when you create your campaigns it'll spin the content automatically for you and then you can submit it and after that you can go to your reports and it only takes about a minute or so for it to send everything out it's really fast and so right here it's going to show you where everything has been done and you can see here these are the ones that are pending that I just set up and didn't actually syndicate now you can also come up here and you can filter your reports because if you do a lot of these you'll want to have to use your filter you can download a CSV file so if you're doing this for clients or you can uh, follow the RSS feed here but using the filter reports and downloading CSV files is something that I do quite a bit of so just keep that in mind but this is the tool that I use for all my syndication for putting my putting everything together into groups and I just wanted to share that with you guys because a lot of you is asking me since I made that post about my video blog network how to do it how to set it up so this is what I use for that so but that's it for this video if you want to check it out at sendable.com I'll put the link under this video as well as the other ones that I mentioned and uh, if you guys like this video and want more types of videos like this leave a comment below and let me know the kind of videos you guys are wanting me to make what you're wanting to learn and subscribe and like to my video in this channel that way uh, you can keep up to date with the new videos that I post so that's it for this one thanks